Racing Series. Peso on Maui, purse of $5,500. Well, this is the Mike Campbell Memorial. The exact uh, trifecta wagering a field of nine, no changes. Number one is Go Bogart by Mike Campbell, Richard Lake of Missouri. Linda Cherry trains, Randy Tharps drives, the one Go Bogart. Number two, Perfect Kiss. By Jim Kiesel and Ch Tom Denise of Ohio, trained by Jim Kiesel. Jim Daly drives the two. Perfect kiss. Number three, Sheer Mess, told by Rastetter and Alexander of Pennsylvania, trained by Gene Rastetter. Ron Harvey drives the three. Sheer Mess. Number four, Rainy Day Sam over the Yellowman Bread Stables Incorporated at Mount Sterling, Ohio, trained by Mitchell Nolt. Jeff Nysonger drives the four. Rainy Day Sam. Number five, Jimmy's Queen. Owned and trained by Jim Duckworth the Canal, Winchester, Ohio. Kyle Wader drives the five. Jimmy's queen. Number six, go Bobby G. By Richard L. Wood and Lancaster, Ohio. Trained by Rick Cartman. Kane Kaufman drives the six. Go Bobby G. Number seven, Northville Albert. By Sam Mullen of Sugar Creek, Ohio. Trained by Dean Santantonio. Darren Benskin drives the seven. Northville Albert. Number eight, Towner Time. By Brent Bowenbacher at Convoy, Ohio. Trained by Dean Bowenbacher. Bob Harper drives the eight. Towner Time. And for the outside of the nine, making history. Owned and trained by John Arrowwood at Dayton, Ohio. Jack Daly drives the nine, making history in the sulky. That's the field for the fifth race. The Columbus Claiming Series final. The Mike Campbell Memorial. Exact to drive back. Memorial. Field in motion. Bing, set on their way. They're all fan pacing and driving right out for the lead. The five, Jimmy's Queen is quick off the gate there from the inside. Go Bogart in two. Driving up on the outside there in third. Towner time. Fourth, that is Perfect Kiss. Five to the inside, Sheer Miss. Sixth, that is Rainy Day Sam. Following up on the inside in seventh by Go Bobby G. Eighth along the rail, Northville Albert in ninth and trailing, making history. Around the first turn and with the lead, but Jimmy's Queen, but Go Bogart is brushing up on the Outside here through an opening quarter at 27 and three fifths. And Go Bogart is now brushed to the front here to lead it by a length and a quarter. Into the inside, Jimmy's Queen is racing in second, a gap at three there in third, counter time. Fourth, that is perfect kiss. Fifth and sheer mist is there. Sixth and first double the outside, Go Bobby G. Seventh is Rainy Day Sam. Eighth, that is Northville Albert and ninth and trailing, making history around the clubhouse turn in front of the panic and at the half. Up top, Go Bogart through a half and 57 and four fifths off the turn and driving down the back side heads are pointed towards three quarters and up top go bogart leading it by a length keeping the two perfect kiss at bay in two inside and third that's jimmy's queen with less than three eighths of a mile to travel second over the outside racing in fourth perfectly placed go bobby g all bottled up racing in five that is towner time third over the outside in sixth rainy day sam seventh is sheer miss they went three quarters and one twenty seven and one and go bogart is the one to catch here leading it by length to the outside perfect kiss swung up three wide that is go bobby g waiting for the rate stre super stretches jimmy's queen less than an eighth of a mile to go and down the stretch they come with go bogart on top within the final 16th go bobby g and jimmy's queen but go bogart wins the mike campbell memorial Finishing second, the five, Jimmy's Queen, and oh, how fitting it is that the one, Go Bogart, takes the Mike Campbell Memorial in the Columbus Claiming Series Final. 5-8 is unofficial. It should be noted that the one, Go Bogart, in a new lifetime mark, 156 flat. Mike Campbell. Age 51 of Plain City, Ohio, Deland, Florida. Died unexpectedly Tuesday morning in the paddock here at Souda Downs. Born December 16th of 1953 in Wilmington, Ohio to Herbert and Jenny Brown Campbell. Was a graduate of Jonathan Alder High School and Urbana University. He was an owner of Mike Campbell Racing Stables. Owned and operated Twin Oaks Golf Course at Dublin, Ohio before he sold it last year. His interests included golf and, of course, cleaning, training and racing of the standard breads. He leaves behind a loving family and friends. 
the winner's circle. I've never seen it like this before. Here at Sada Downs, it is absolutely packed. And it's oh so fitting that the one go Bogart here this evening wins the fifth race, the final of the Columbus Claiming Series. He was one of Mike's favorite horses. Ladies and gentlemen, the one go Bogart wins the Mike Campbell Memorial. So fitting, and Mike smiling down from up above on the one go Bogart, a four-year-old bay horse by Art Escape out of an O Nukes mare so tough. Owned by Mike Campbell of Ohio and Lincoln, Missouri. Trained by trainer of record, Linda Cherry. Nicely handled here this evening, gate to wire virtually by Randy Tharps. At this time, Saturday down staff and track management, the family and friends of Mike Campbell are gathering in the winner's circle to remember a great friend and a loving family member. Mike Campbell, the age of 51, died unexpectedly on Tuesday morning. Ladies and gentlemen, Saturday Down staff and track management would like to ask that at this time we take a moment of silence and remember our friend, Mike Campbell. A moment of silence, please.